See, we spend so much time filtering things based on our, our race and our economic status and our political affiliations and our occupation and our education when our own one and only filter should ever be, what does my God and his word say? This is our filter for life. This is how we should view the people around us. This is how we should make decisions about life and the things that we're gonna do, not this. And until we can get to a place where we start to truly see people through God's eyes and, and start to live as though we are truly children of God, we're gonna live in a world of disunity. That's why Paul said, I urge you to walk in a manner worthy of the calling to which you have been called. He's saying, I urge you to walk like you're a part of this family, that this family is what comes first, that our father is the one who sets the standard, that we live according to his word and not what the world around us is trying to say to us because we can all be one without being the same here's the deal God has made you unique for a purpose and if you spend your whole life trying to conform to the people around you you will lose the purpose that God created you for if you spend your whole life trying to conform to everything that's going on around you in your workplace, in your school, what you hear on the radio or see on TV, you will lose the purpose that God created you for because he wants to use your uniqueness to reach people that I would never be able to reach.